In this video, we're going to look at how to convey documents in Loft. So this is going to be more applicable to our Canadian clients. If you're a US client, you may not find this video as useful because you will probably not convey documents to lawyers, but our Canadian clients will prepare uh, packages that they need to send to the lawyers on each uh, deal that they work on. So I'm going to go over the basics of conveying from the Loft 47 platform. Now over on the left hand menu, you can see here I am within a deal. So I'm just in the deal menu here. You see that this is the property address 110696 Sulphur Springs. Now what we need to do first of all, before you do any conveyancing, you need to work through these left hand menus. You need to ensure that all of the details on the deal have been added. You need to make sure all of your people are on the deals. So when I say all of the people, I mean everyone from the buyer, seller, outside brokerage. You need both of the lawyers to be in there and you need uh, the outside broker. So, so, so everyone that's associated to this deal needs to be in the people page. And I can't uh, emphasize that enough. If you miss somebody here, then they are not going to appear on your report. So it's important that you don't skip any, uh, you know, skip any corners and try and uh, miss something out here. You want to make sure that everybody is in the system and they will appear on the reports. You also want to review your commissions as well. Make sure the commissions are correct in the commissions page. You also want to quickly jump into the allocations page as well. You can see here on this particular deal, we only have an allocation for our agent, Jenny, because Jenny is the only uh, person we are paying on this deal. If you were paying the outside brokerage, remember you'd have to add an allocation for them by selecting them here. So that's important because obviously if you select the outside brokerage, that is going to increase the amount of expected funds. So important for your conveyancing reports that you send out. So be careful that you have the correct allocations on this page. Once you've done that and you've added the correct allocations, you've, you've reviewed all of these uh, menus above, you can now go down to the admin report. This is where we will actually convey documents and send documents to the lawyers. And you can see here, we have the administrator instruction report built into the platform. So we've got three reports in this area. The Administrator instruction report is effectively your conveyancing instructions. Now all of the people that we added to the deal earlier on, the sellers, lawyers, outside brokerage, you can see all of their information is feeding through. You can see the close date on the deal. So we just have a close date for this brokerage. We've got the legal description as well. We've got the sell price. And it also states who's holding the deposit on this deal. The second report here is the commissions report very basic report but it gives you what what you need to see it gives you the total commissions on the deal and it gives you the sell and the list side so really really clear for the lawyers to see what's happening in terms of the commission and then the final report is the financial summary now this one really breaks it down for the lawyers they can see who is holding the deposit funds and how much they can see how much commission the brokerage is earning your brokerage they can see how much the balance of funds to be received so this is what you are expecting this is what you are telling the lawyers you are waiting to receive so once you've reviewed all of this and it's accurate and remember if something isn't accurate here it is because you've you've added it incorrectly on one of these menus on the left so go in and check once you've checked everything over though and you're happy we can now convey the documents to the lawyers and all you have to do in Loft is click the share button up at the top. You're going to enter your uh, lawyer's email address. They'll already be in the deal. So you'll just select the lawyer. You're going to add your subject line as you uh, normally would. So I will spell that correctly. And we will select the correct template. Now, Loft will add the templates for your area and they're only going to be rough templates so do look out for the email templates video on loft tv because you can customize your templates to make them exactly how you need them to be 
uh, for when you convey to lawyers. So you can see here, for example, I've created a seller lawyer letter. So I'm going to use that one. And it has all of the information I need. If I hit preview, it gives me all of the wording. It, it gives some of the, the, the information on the deal as well. And it effectively lets them know what we are attaching. I can then come down here to the report section where I can go ahead and select those three reports that we looked at a moment ago. The deal summary, which was the conveyance instructions, the administrator report. The commission summary, if you remember, that was the breakdown of all the commission. And the financial summary, which was the uh, report that gives us the amount that we need to receive from the lawyer. The only one you wouldn't send is a CDA. That That is more for our US clients in the Texas region. So you wouldn't send the CDA, you'll send the financial summary. So those three reports will go to the lawyers and you can then go ahead and select any deal documents that you might have. I haven't got any here, but obviously if you've uploaded deal documents, such as the contract, any addendums, anything that the lawyer's going to need, they'll be available here and you can just attach them to it. And you can then hit the send button and send your conveyancing off to the lawyer. So really easy to send conveyancing from Loft. Thanks for watching.